that shit ain't for me no more. Sometimes you just got to realize that sometimes you just got to be that nigga to be like, man, this shit ain't for me no more. But a lot of y'all niggas, y'all get peer pressured into shit that y'all don't even be wanting to do. Y'all motherfuckers don't even be really wanting to smoke weed, but just because y'all see a nigga who y'all think cool, or y'all see, you know what I'm saying, this nigga or that nigga doing it, y'all don't do it. Man, fuck that. When I hit that motherfucking weed and I start tripping, bitch, shit, nigga. Y'all can have that shit. It ain't about to have me in this motherfucker twigging. <laughs> nigga, look. Look, check me out, y'all. I'm the type of nigga, bro, that, bro, like, I start thinking about some, bro, I be tweaking, bro. I'm the last man, bro. I be thinking about some crazy shit, bro. Like, for real, if you, and just, bro, like, have you been high, my nigga? And, like, like, I start thinking about some shit, like, I remember one time I was high, bro. I was high as fuck. And I start thinking about this shit, like, like, bro, like, nigga, we're in a big-ass ball in the middle of fucking nowhere, my nigga. What? Do you, do you know? Like, we're in a ball, bro. A fucking ball, bro. A ball that's fucking spinning fast as fuck in the middle of fucking... It's not spinning fast, but it's spinning. We're in the middle of nowhere. Like, what if the ball falls or something? Like, bitch, I be thinking about that shit, bro. That's why I had to stop smoking weed, bro. Because I start panicking. And I'm like, oh, my God. And I just take the fuck off. This is what's like, this was before I was with Miss D. You know what I'm saying? I was in a hotel, bro. And the motherfucker I was with. The motherfucker I was with. What's up, Willie? She was like, my grandpa said weed. I'm finna go get some. I'm like, all right, cool. Go kiss the weed. She was like, you gonna smoke? I said, hell no, I ain't smoking. I said, nah, you know, I, I don't want to smoke. Cause, you know, I got real bad anxiety, so I don't want to smoke. You know, this is why I thought I was a rapper and shit. So everywhere I went, I had my microphone and shit. I had my computer everywhere I went. So we was in a hotel and shit. So she got the bag of weed and shit. She was like, come on, smoke with me, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be, be cool and shit. Try to impress the motherfucking shit. So I was like, you know what? <laughs> I said, fuck it. Fuck it, I'm gonna hit this. Fuck it, I'm gonna hit the weed, bro. I'm gonna hit that bitch, bro. Fuck it, bro. Girl, I already knew I was finna start tripping. But I, I, I told her. I said, I said, I said, bro, if I hit this weed, bro, and I started tripping, I said, bro, you gotta do something. You go, you gotta have to do something, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Try to calm me down, because I'm gonna be tripping. She's like, yeah, I ain't gonna be tripping. Like, it, it, it's, I'm all right, cool. Fuck it, nigga. So, nigga. Man, so she, she, she fired up the blunt. I hit the blunt too, so I was like, you know what, you know, what? I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just hit the weed, and I'm gonna just start rapping, because I had my mic, I had my computer, I had my beat, I had my, you know what I'm saying, I had my headphones and shit. So nigga, I said, fuck it, I hit the weed, I start rapping, I start rapping. You know, alright, everything ain't cool. You know what I'm saying? I'm just, I'm, I'm freestyling this shit on the mic, recording this shit. And then next thing you know, nigga, my shit just start beat, nigga. And all of a sudden, out of nowhere, God kill me right now if I'm lying, my nigga. Out of nowhere, nigga, I said, woo, nigga, real loud and threw the motherfucking mic on the floor, nigga. And busted out the motherfucking door, nigga. It's like 5.35, 45 in the morning, nigga. I was so, I was high, bro. I was high, bro. And, and I didn't know what to do, bro. I just, I, I, I panicked. I panicked. I, I just, I, I screamed real loud. I, I fucking... Threw the mic on the goddamn floor. She was like, what's wrong? What's wrong? I said, I said, I, I said I was, bro, I swear to God. Hey, I swear to God, bro. I swear to God. She was like, what's wrong with you? I said, man, I'm good. I'm good. That's all I was saying. I'm good. I'm straight. I'll be back. I'm straight. I was just like, nigga, the motherfucking hotel manager came outside. He was like, say, man, you all right? I said, I was like, man, I'm good, bro. I'm good, bro. I'm good. Bitch, I start walking down the access road of the motherfucking hotel, bitch. I'm high than E, motherfucker, bro. I hit that bitch twice. I'm sitting there like, bro, why the fuck? In my mind, I'm sitting there like, why in the fuck is she not fucking acting like this? Why, how come she ain't acting like this? What's in this weed? Or what the fuck did she put in this weed? Because she ain't acting like that. She just chilling. You know, I had an anxiety attack, bro, and I panicked, my nigga. I'm walking down the fucking access road for about a good 30 minutes, nigga. I, I see her motherfucking ass. She come over there, grab me, give me a hug and shit. And I walk back to the hotel room. And when I walk back to the whole hotel room, 
I was alright because that high left. Because I only hit the I only hit the blunt like one or two times, so I wasn't that high. But I was high because my anxiety, I was, you know, my anxiety kicked in, and I felt like I couldn't do nothing. Like I wanted to get on high so bad, and I couldn't, bro. And and I walked back to the hotel room, bro. And uh, I I I prayed, bro. And I I said, God, I said I told God, I said if you if you make me on high. I will never smoke weed again. And, and and I ain't smoked weed since that day, bro. Since that day, bro. I haven't, bro. I ain't smoked weed since that day, bro. True story, bro. I don't know what the fuck. Let me hit that though. Let's go, TK.